hopefully that's all up and running. Right, this is just a quick stream just so that I can save something to my YouTube channel without having to make a video and then upload it. But I've just noticed something. There's an arcade ticket in Nact, uh, which has been found in the New Revelations map. Um, if you look at it, it's got all these numbers 1 to 5. Um, clearly it's a cipher. But the thing that's really kind of got me was like, okay, it's a cipher. I wonder what it means. I wonder if I can figure it out. So looking at it, I'm thinking, okay, it only has the numbers 1 to 5. Um, so I was looking for all the different kinds of ciphers that you could have. And the one that got brought up a while ago was the tap cipher. So if we look at um, tap codes and how they work, it uses obviously the numbers 1 to 5 and things like that uh, with your key square. Something else that's been noticed in the game, um, in the sky funnily enough, is an alphabet. An alphabet that looks very similar to this, except obviously I and J are both combined together. Um, so, I believe it's I and J. Yeah, I and J are both combined together. So, um, what I did was I took these these numbers here, which you can see, we've got 1, 4, 2, 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, um, and I broke them up into um, groups of two. So you got 1, 4, 2, 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 5, 3. If you do that and run it through a tap cipher with the grid, you get D, F, A, G, X, A, G, A, F, F, this looks very fi like similar to an ADFGX cipher. Um, now, I obviously, if for whatever reason there was one two or one three or one uh, five, for instance, you'd have a B, a C, an E. But never once in this entire series you see things like five five or anything like that. They're all things. I mean, you got here um, a four five, but that could be one four or uh, one four or five three. Um, let me just just here uh, you have to go through in order to find out which one it is because obviously it's in groups of twos but I'm pretty sure that every time you do this I mean one four would be a D so again that's probably most likely a D uh, rather than the four five which would be a U so I'm, I'm pretty sure that would be that and if that was that uh, what we got um, one four then it'd be a five three which a five three would be an X so again, it's looking like this is an ADFGX cipher that's in, like, it's a double encoded tap code slash ADFGX cipher. Now obviously the only other ADFGX cipher that we have is the Mob of the Dead cipher. And obviously this is a tap code cipher, which the tap code cipher was also known as a prison cipher. So it could be this helps us decipher the ADFGX cipher that is in Mob of the Dead. So... If I'm right about this, that means that we're using a prison cipher or a prison tap cipher here, which is then encoded with an ADFGX cipher, which we then need to decode in order to figure out what this says. Which, again, like I say, if we're using an ADFGX cipher on the tap, si tap code, it may be that we use the same ADFGX cipher key in this to decode the one that's in Mob of the Dead. So, this is definitely something that needs to be looked into. Um, it may be that because of the amount of information that we've got here, obviously this here, we may get one plain text out of all of this, or looking at it, there may be, I mean, if you, if you look here, you've got one, oh, let me, let me full screen this. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven here. This is the thing, we've got seven here, and we've got this odd one here. This one here could be... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 30 divided by 2 is 15, 15, this could be a 15 letter long word or something, which could be the key to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, these 7, um, with there being 7, there's also other ciphers, this is the only downfall, there's also other ciphers where you use seven keys, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, all down in a row to figure something else out. Um, whether it's triple encrypted, I don't know, but if so, that would mean that this would be one ADFGX, this would be one ADFGX, this would be, then you decrypt that, and then you'd be left with um, seven different strings, like seven different alphabets or something, um, and if you got seven different alphabets, you could then use that to make a key square or something. I, I honestly don't know, but looking at this, it looks like you've got seven different ADFGX ciphers and a keyword. That's what I'd say this is. And if that is the case, 
then this is most likely linked to Mob of the Dead because it's a prison tap code that's linked to an ADFGX cipher. It all kind of makes sense to be Mob of the Dead. So I would say if there are any cipher people out there, I mean, I'm, I'm busy hunting for the Easter egg and stuff, but if I ever get the chance, I will jump on this. But if there's anyone who is good at ciphers, please check this out, share it, bug Mr. Ruffles about it, get them on this, because this ticket, this seems to be the major key. It has it has a key there, which is most likely a keyword. Seven different ADFGX ciphers that are all tap codes, which are prison. It, it's just it, there's so much here that, that that we need to look into. So, um, like I say, this this is a quickly uploaded video that I've, I've streamed to to get this out there. Share it, get Ruffles' attention, and get him to sort this out. Like, or maybe he knows somebody that can t can figure this out. But this it's important. It's important, guys.